Butterfly gon' recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime road. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was crazy out there. Thomas Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the fire flies. When you start rapping like that, I've been got his body chronic in the North County, boy, you know what's up. Mira, 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 papi, what you need? Did you know I got it for the love? We be rushing orders in and out the dog. If, if me and like me and Cortez been going at it for some years, right? That's just a bag that I got marinating. I'm not writing for Cortez now until I get paid for it. So I, it's not like John John's yeah. writing for me. You got some shit. Nah, 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 nah. That ain't you might not write. Us. You might not write. You, got some, you, you got, got some lines. It's yeah. a mistake. No, no, they even was saying he's right. Subconsciously in your head yeah, that yeah. when the name not Cortez me, comes up, I could just I feel like I rap, but I've rap better than niggas. Like, if, if you pay attention to my t material, though, you got like certain motherfuckers. Like I don't do personals. I, like you never hear, you never hear. Yo, you heard that round about Surf talking about his mom, his daughter, his. Daughter. I don't do no type of personals. Mm -hmm. I just genuinely feel like I, which was my pro and my con. At some point, I felt like, oh, I rap better than these niggas. I gotta stop showing it. So I stopped pulling up with three rounds and stuff like that because I can beat y'all with two rounds. By the time we get to the third, by definition, this battle's over. I only got to win two. So I got comf comfortable comfortable and arrogant. You give me the... You know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc., etc. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. Got my guy with me. Showtime, SP, to nobody that knows bodies. Bye. All right, so the question is, right? Mm -hmm. Sue Sir versus Cortez coming up. Yep. And uh, does Sue Surf need to 3 0 Cortez? 30. Does he need to 30? Like, so I, I want to paint this picture, right? Go ahead. So you have Cortez who's coming into a battle with Surf, right? Mm. The expect, like the expectations are a lot. A lot of people are saying, you know, he's going to lose. He's getting 30. He's going to lose. He's going to lose because the opponents that Surf battled previously, mm -hmm. you know, they asked him, oh, do you think you're better than? He's like, yeah, I think I'm better than this person. I think I'm better than that person. But mm -hmm. Cortez is in a position to do something. You know that he hasn't done before which is battle a top name opponent in recent times on a url card you know what i'm saying like if he if he's gotten on these cards it's been some good talent some decent talent some subsidiary talent but now he's getting a big name that's on a streak right so i told uh surf you know i speak to him every now and then and things like that you know and he's in his bag preparing and things like that and in this game you know everything that you do get scrutinized, you know what I'm saying? Like whether whether whoever you battling, whoever you walk, whoever you talk, you people make blogs about shit, people make blogs about me. They don't be true, but they make them anyway, you know what I'm saying? But what I'm saying is, once you become a figure, you give away your right mm -hmm. to anonymity. Like, you know, people will say whatever they want. It is what it is, you know what I mean? But at the end of the day, you know what you're supposed to be accomplishing, what's in front of you. So Surf mm -hmm. is battling against uh, Cortez, right? So, with what he's been doing, mm -hmm. the question now becomes, does he have to 3-0 Cortez? Like, if Cortez wins a round on him, is it a win for him? Not as far as the battle, but, you know what I'm saying, if you come into a battle where most people feel like you're gonna lose, if you win a round, like, does it become a, a, a bigger story? This is basically the question. After thinking about it, because I was about to jump right out the gate. Yeah, he going at the 30 Cortez, because I don't believe him. I don't think he can do 12 rounds in a row. Right. You get what I'm saying? I could do that. The if factor is gone, mm -hmm. right? It, it's, it's, it's lingering, but the if factor is gone. Right. With that being said, the only thing that I would prefer is that this battle lives up to the hype that I want it to be in. Mm. You get what I'm saying? So I want Sue Surf to come with the tenacity of having a 30, trying to 30 Cortez. Mm -hmm. I want Cortez having the tenacity to also feel the same so that maybe this battle can be debated amongst us. Right. You get what I'm saying? It ain't, if anything, the battle being great, then only boosts both of their stock. Mm. If Cortez 30 Surf, that just means Surf gonna get booked on the next card, and whoever he, whoever Surf's battle, man, you like Cortez. It, that's gonna be the angle. It don't matter. Surf still getting booked. He's still gonna get that bag. You get what I'm saying? With Cortez, he has more to lose because you finally got what you asked for, and Cortez doesn't deliver. Like, mm -hmm. like doesn't deliver. Then we got a problem. But what if Cortez still gets three rounds where? People like me, mm -hmm. who always likes to give it up for the underdog, or people like me, who hates on surf, I just like to say, if the battle is great enough, 
and the battle is going to be considered debatable, both of them can win. Mm -hmm. With the anonymity, like with Surf saying that, you know, he he has a lot to live up to, of course, you still have that chip on your shoulder. You still got that monkey on your back. Even though it, it's, like, it's just like when you kick a habit, it's still there. Mm -hmm. It could possibly be, but you get rewarded and you get all of the accolades when you keep going forward and forgetting about what you're supposed to be doing. Mm -hmm. Your goal for Surf's goal is to just kill Cortez. Never make sure that he's not even around to, to be mentioned anymore. Don't send me no kids. Mm -hmm. Keep that same energy. For Cortez, I deserve this position and I deserve to be way farther than you. Mm -hmm. That's, that's, that's. That's the only thing Cortez got to do. It's not, because to me, in my mind, Cortez can't just win. Mm -hmm. He has to make it debatably clear. But the thing is, how is he going to do that in front of a crowd? Like, it was like a volume room where, like, read battle, surf, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Or, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, those volume rooms where it was, like, a controlled environment, that's mm -hmm. one thing. But when you have a stage, and this is what I want to do, right? So, you have a stage is where he battled John John. Mm -hmm. A stage is where he battles... Calico, you know what I'm saying? Like a pretty much a stage, you mm. know what I'm saying? And then the twerk battle was, you know, that was it too. That was a stage. That was a stage too. A stage. These stage performances, he's getting off clean. You right. know what I'm saying? Like he's rapping, rapping, and he's coming with three rounds. Like when Surf has three rounds, and I'm not just using that as the narrative, mm -hmm. when he has three rounds, he's like very tough to beat. You know what I'm saying? Like his la I can't remember, I'll have to think back to a battle that I had him losing where he actually had three rounds, you know? Mm. And when I said you are not below scrutiny mm. and you give away your anonymity when you become who you are, mm. if you think of it like this, right? There's somebody out there, I don't know who, that played against Jordan or played against Kobe in high school and probably won these games, you know what I'm saying? Mm. You think they're not still living on the fact that they beat Michael Jordan in a high school playoff game or beat Kobe Bryant in a state championship or something like that? Yeah. Like, they live off of that. Yeah. You know? And it might not be nothing to the person that it happened against. Right. <laughs> but it's the world to the person who did it. Mm. So, mm. when it comes to Cortez, Cortez is a talented MC. You know what I'm saying? Like, he has bars. He has skills. He has punches. But he's coming into this as a heavy underdog. Mm. I just watched the number two Kentucky team lose to a number 15 in the NCAA tournament. It's so it's very possible. Very possible. But the thing is, he's got to be I, like, okay. It's convincing. <laughs> he's got to be a little explosive, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, More he's got to be, he's got to have some explosiveness to him that. Have, have have we seen that? Like, have you seen that, though? In recent times, have you seen. In recent times, no. I'm. If we keep it all the way 100, in recent times, Surf has been running the big stage. Like, and we're talking about like the the guys that were rocking the stage are are considered lower than Surf's hype right now. Mm -hmm. Easy's rocking the big stage. Right. A guy, a lot of people are are under them that was usually considered rocking the stage. But what happens is, if the battle can be heard. Like, Cortez ain't no slouch. Mm -hmm. Cortez doesn't fall short to the crowd. Cortez never really loses to the crowd. Mm -hmm. His material may not be good for the crowd, but Cortez still gets through that material. Right. You get what I'm saying? The, the And I can think of some big big stage big stage performances from Cortez. Mm -hmm. Cor you know, versus Twerk and La Bachata. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and I can think of a surf performance where surf got through all three rounds. But even in that aspect, the word on the street was that Surf still won. Mm -hmm. And that was him versus Hollow. Mm -hmm. Because word of mouth was Surf 30 Hollow. 30 Hollow. Mm -hmm. That's what they said. Yeah. And when the footage dropped, it was like, oh, I don't know. Surf kind of got it, but her, you know what I'm saying? It's, it, it's going to be different, especially live in the building. Of course, Surf is probably going to win. I, ooh. You know how you know how Cortez can win this battle? How? If or you know how Cortez is making this battle even close mm. when there is no 3 0 chain. Mm. Yeah, yeah. When you don't hear if if at the after the second round you see a lot of this, mm -hmm. Cortez is he's he's solidified. Just finish your third round, let it be for us to debate that. You know what I'm saying? It's this is what I'm looking for. 
I'm looking for this. All right. So, cause, cause you can't say can Cortez get around. Cortez has to get two rounds. Cause even if he gets around, it can either be the first or the third. Mm -hmm. Third for the uh, first for the shock factor. Oh, he wasn't supposed to be that hot. Or maybe the fact that he went second, mm -hmm. something like that. Or the third round, cause that's the third round that we need to speak about. And that's usually Surf's lightest round. Mm -hmm. It is in fact Surf's lightest round. I mean, in this little run right here, I don't know, man. <laughs> this little run, it's been three, three of them things back to back. So hold up. Go ahead, go ahead with you. Right. I think Cortez, in order to make this a battle, has to win the first round, honestly, because the first round, Sue Surf is gonna come out and he's gonna talk. You know, like he's gonna talk. Yeah. Like that's just what he's gonna do. Mm -hmm. You know, like he 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 does that. Like you know you know. Wouldn't to see, come to see. You wouldn't even be in this battle if it wasn't for me. Like he starts doing that shit. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? He starts talking to him. And like, You're welcome. You know, yeah, like, this is my stage, my <laughs> set, my sound. Welcome. If it wasn't for me, you wouldn't even be around. Like mm -hmm. that type of shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like kick it with you. Like if if you wasn't, if I wasn't, if I kick it with you. Mm -hmm. If I ain't pick you to be on this card to get in this venue, you'd have to have a ticket with you. Like he starts doing that type of shit. Yeah. That starts making it seem like. You was here and I was there type shit. Cause the thing is, one thing I will say about Cortez, Surf respected Cortez at one time. You know what I'm saying? He, he, he won the battle him because of Cortez's consistency mm -hmm. after the Hitman, after the Big T. You know what I'm saying? Like after them joints mm -hmm. where he first came in, Marv One, when he first was uh, stepping on the scene, he was very consistent. You know what I mean? And he still is. That's one thing about Cortez. He's been a brand of consistency for a long time. I don't feel like mm -hmm. that's just my personal opinion. I don't feel like he had got he's gotten the battles and the names on the biggest cards, you know what I'm saying? Nah, he's not and then he had the vault sin the vault syndrome where battles were getting vaulted, you know what I mean, things like that. But now I think when we say this, who has more to lose? Cortez has more to lose and Cortez has more to gain. Yeah. He has more to lose. Yes. He has more to lose yes. and, and more, more to, to gain. gain. The reason why I say that is this. To lose mm -hmm. a battle of this magnitude, I don't know when another one's coming. Just going to be honest with you. I don't. Because there's a lot of people that they yeah. felt like him battling him was like, what? Goods was out there. This person was out there. You took. That's what people are saying. But mm. does this bet? Does this Cortez beat? If Cortez beats, if Cortez beats Surf. Mm -hmm. Does this stop the gatekeeper talk for Cortez? It does. Or the or the or the exhibition. For it does. You hear what I'm saying? Like, if he beats uh, him, it does. Uh, throw a Cortez a battle. No, it does a lot for him. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It can. But that's also up to it's up you. Yeah, it's it's pre-battle, battle and post-battle Cortez. That that's that's the. That's the narrative that I'm pushing. It's but but, it's it, but the question remains, mm -hmm. does he need to 3-0 him? Yes or no? Does Surf need to 3-0 Cortez? Yes. Truth be told, no. Okay. If, if I can be honest with you, no. But Surf still needs three rounds. Of course. So let's say that. Like I said, like I don't want... Because I don't want to run nitty situation mm -hmm. where he was like, man, I feel like I was killing, killing him already. I'm like, no. Nah. Mm -hmm. Overkill, because if you feel like you killed him already, kill him some more. Make him never, you know, be seen again. That's the, that's what we want, sir. But he's had a, comp uh, the only thing is, uh, it's like, I really want to see the best version of Cortez, because he's going to need it. Like, you, when you're at a competitive disadvantage with somebody who's a fan favorite, mm. it's really hard to get the fan favorite, the people to turn their back or go against the fan favorite, you know what I mean? So you got to kill it, so... You can get it in the building, hopefully, but definitely camera. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, right. That if on camera, it's more clear and concise for Cortez. Then yes, Cortez can get that because you already know in the building the crowd is going to say surf what. The crowd is saying surf it, wins. Even if you make it two one, like you know, or one of them battles that it could go either way. I don't care. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah, those I'll, are fire. Like Ron Eddie versus Chilla Jones. Yes. And go either way. I don't care. I don't care. Easy to block out versus be fire, chess. It can go either way. I don't care. You know what I'm saying? Like. You have to live up to that expectation because the thing is, Surf has proved it yeah. in the last three cards, back to back to back. But Cortez, you wasn't on any of those cards. Not to mention, Surf did the same run that Cortez did mm -hmm. in a tournament. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. 
there had to be some motivation on the line for Cortez to be that consistent in that manner. Mm -hmm. And for him to still come that close and still lose. This is the one, it, it, to me, this is his championship for him. Because mm -hmm. even though the bag ain't 150K, but still, you get served. He be ace in a judge battle, though. Huh? He be ace in a judge battle. <laughs> And he was belittled after that battle. And that battle wasn't good. That's, no. that's not, I'm about to say, it wasn't the best Cortez or Ace. No. So, that is, the, like I said, it's, ah, uh, it's like watching Seth Curry versus Steph Curry. You really, like, you know who's the better shooter. Mm -hmm. You know who's the better shooter. But, mm -hmm. he grew up with him. He know his weak. He, Seth knows Steph. Uh, Steph, yes. Yeah, Steph, Seth knows Steph weaknesses. He's in his ear all day. I was your competition your whole life. Yeah. He has Cortez is the set mm -hmm. to serve Steph. Quote me on that. Mm -hmm. They ain't brothers, but damn it. Long story short, you know we're moving again. Who you got winning? I still got Surf winning this battle. I, you know, <laughs> I still got Surf winning this battle. Mm -hmm. But I, I am prepared to be wild. I'm gonna say that. I can do that. Gang! Mira, 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 papi, what you need? Did you know I got it for the love? We be rushing orders in and out the door. No, I'm on the go. Hit me on the phone.